My name is uh, Timothy Pullman. I'm a surgeon at Woodlawn Hospital in Rochester, Indiana. Usually I always get the question, why, why uh, are you vaccinated? You know, I'm not around a lot of people. I'm not really exposed to it a lot. Um, are, isn't the government experimenting on, on people? This vaccine came up so quick, you know, the usual kind of answers and, or, or questions. And, and, and I usually I sort of sit down and say, look, I'm kind of talking to you now, not as your surgeon, but I just want to talk to you as a, as, as somebody, um, you know, possibly your friend. You know, I just want to talk to you as a person that uh, that this is unprecedented. That, that what's happened is is unprecedented, and the solution came along in a, in a way that is also unprecedented. So I get it. I get. It. I understand the sort of maybe a little skepticism, a little bit of why you're not quite convinced that it's the best way to go. Um, but let me tell you that the vaccine itself is incredibly safe. And I think it makes absolutely no sense at all to not be vaccinated to prevent yourself from being infected with this virus. And the benefits are way up here, and the dangers are so far down here that they're not even a comparison. Bottom line is, uh, the, the disease is real. The virus exists. It's very contagious. And the best way you can protect yourself is maintain social distance, wear a mask until you get vaccinated. And then once you're vaccinated, still take precautions to prevent transmission of the disease that you might be colonized with.